Hey everyone, so here we are reviewing the Essence Nail Art, and this is the color and go. So, this, they don't actually have any colors, I don't think so. Okay, on the bottle of this one, this is 15, this one says 27. So, I don't know if those are the colors, but this one's a baby pink, and this one is a, I want to say black, but it's more of an emerald green color. At first, it looked really black, but it is actually emerald green. And also the Essence Nail Art Decoration Kit. So I'm going to start off with this because this is one of the cutest things I've ever seen. I actually haven't seen anyone else give, like, have something like this. When you open it up, it comes in a little pack. And you have four different things. You have you have five different things. You have a piece of tin foil, and I believe it's aluminum. And then you have a bunch of these kind of snowflake like, sparkles. And then you have a bows for your, like, ring finger and you have octagons and sparkles and these are kind of just like flakes I am most excited for these this because I saw a picture on tumblr where they took this and they put it over top of a red coat and they put a red coat over top and it looked so cool so I I don't know if essence was reading my mind or something but this is the most I am so happy when I kind of saw this I kind of freaked out my parents were just wondering what the hell am I doing but this is the coolest thing ever. Like, I have never seen anyone sell a product like this. Not even Revlon or Sal Hansen. Does Sal Hansen sell this? I don't know. I could imagine that this isn't that expensive. It is for sure in everyone's price range. And it's, like, so great for Halloween. I am going to use these for Christmas and my birthday because who doesn't love pretty nails? All you have to do is you take this. And I already tried it out with the uh, octagons. All you do is you take your nails and you can either put it one by one. Or what I did was I wet my nails and then I dipped it. I dipped my wet nail into the mixture. And I kind of got, like, a really nice pattern. It looked so pretty. And these are so easy to take off if you put a base underneath them or if you put glue underneath them. So I would, it is kind of hard to take them off if you don't have a base. But you should treat it like you treat normal glitter nail polish so you know wrap it in acid wrap it with acetate put a paper towel put a put a cotton ball over top of it and then take it off later so this is just the coolest thing and the bows are the cutest things ever i would recommend using nail polish glue if you want to use the bows but i'm sure if you just put it on wet nail polish and put a couple of top coats over top it should stay fine once again, like, this is just the cutest and coolest thing ever, and it does come with instructions on the back. Okay, so you have two different options. You can either pick it up with your nail pull, with your nail brush, and you put it over top, or you can take them one by one and put them on your nail. So, I guess they don't have the way I did it, but this is so cool, and it's so pretty, and this is something that someone would love to get for the Christmas gift, so if you're thinking ahead, or this is something great for goodie bags, if you're into giving goodie bags, I know, I think I might end up buying a bunch of these for my friends goodie bags for my birthday or for secret santa like who doesn't want a bunch of pretty next i'm gonna go with the emerald green just because i'm so attracted to this color so first when i saw it it was late at night and i really didn't pay much attention to it because i thought it was black and i was kind of excited because i didn't have a good black color but then i looked at it the next day i'm like wait this is a really weird black and it's actually emerald green it is the prettiest color ever it's a really deep emerald greenish it kind of screams christmas to me because it's the color of a christmas tree or the sap or no not the sap it's the color of a christmas tree and i am absolutely head over heels for this it is such a shiny color payoff it goes on really opaque it's so nice and oh my goodness i don't know why i never tried the essence nail polishes I always stay clear of like, I don't know why, but I never just go buy the drugstore nail polishes just because I'm like, oh, it's a dollar, it's probably really bad, but it, like, come on, you put it on, you wait like two minutes, it takes two minutes for it to dry, not even two minutes, it dries so quickly. You wait, and then as soon as it's dry, sorry, this bang is really bothering me. As soon as you dry, you go over with a you go over another coat just because I like it a bit thicker color. And then once it's done, I don't even need a top coat because that's how shiny and opaque this thing is. It has such a pretty color, and I am so obsessed with it. And this plus my nail octagons looks so pretty because it gives it like a really nice, cool, different thing. And my favorite combination for Christmas is for sure going to be this color and this red. Like, does this not scream Christmas to you? Because all I can hear is Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. And then the next color is the number 15 by Essence. So I first looked at this and I was really happy because it looked like a really pretty color. 
and then I tried on my nail and then I was kind of confused because nothing would happen it was just kind of dry and I was really confused on what's going on and little did I know this is an exact dupe for my China Glaze Innocence color exact same color this has a better formula twelve dollars one dollar are you kidding me like obviously I'm gonna go buy this next time it took me seven coats for each finger to get what three coats of this took like why why would I use this when I have this now this color it dried really well China Glaze does have a really nice formula where it's really smooth but it does go on really thin so you do have to go over a bunch of coats but I didn't need a top coat for this for some reason for this color I did need a top coat because it just wasn't as shiny but I only went on this for three coats and I'll insert a picture here I dare you to try to figure out which color I which nails I use this and which nails I use this you will not be able to tell I couldn't even tell my mom couldn't tell I just find it's so funny that this is an exact dupe and I actually had my nails painted this color when I received this so I was so confused at first but I'm so happy I found a dupe because I love finding dupes why would I spend $12 when I can buy this for $1 I can go buy 12 more of these 11 more of these but the formula once again is almost the exact same as the other one except this one isn't as shiny but I do love them both equally I'm the most excited to try this on I'm just waiting for it to get a bit more into the Christmas theme I'm probably gonna wear this for the first week of November to get my you know Christmas pumps but I am so excited for all of this nail art I know that my nails are gonna look so pretty for the entire month of October November December January February March April May June July August November, 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 November. So that kind of has been my nail polish review for Essence. Basically, Essence is a nail polish. Essence nail polishes is something that is affordable. It has really good formula. It has doesn't have the best color selection, but if you do find a color you like, it you should go for it because the price is so unbelievable. The formula is so unbelievable. The dupes are so unbelievable, and the nail art is so cute. The only downside would be that these have a horrendous smell. It smells so strong. And it kind of makes you want to gag a bit, but if you can like handle it for a couple minutes, it leaves in the first 10 minutes. But for that 10 minutes, I would open up a window or something because it is really strong. Other than that, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And click on my face to go for, to another review from Essence, which is actually a bronzer, lip gloss, and blush review that I just did as well. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!